And now we're getting ready here for our second match of the night. It's the Extreme Style Championship match between Shinsuke Nakamura and Drew McIntyre. And here comes the man that made his GCW debut at the Royal Rumble last month, Drew McIntyre. And he had a very impressive showing and he fits into the Extreme Style division so well. McIntyre, of course, made it here tonight by eliminating Shinsuke Nakamura from the Royal Rumble match via Claymore kick. The only question is, can Drew McIntyre repeat what he did at the Royal Rumble here tonight at GCW WrestleMania? It's a huge stage for him. And his first singles match is for the Extreme Style Championship, so huge opportunity for McIntyre here tonight. The Extreme Style Championship is our newest championship here in GCW, and this is the first title defense for Shinsuke Nakamura after securing the uh, brand new championship belt at the Royal Rumble. This championship is not about hardcore matches, it is more about an extreme style, a strong style that these uh, workers uh, bring to the table here tonight. Uh, it's not about using steel chairs, tables, ladders. It's more about the hard hitting style that both of these men will bring to the table here tonight. Uh, Shinsuke Nakamura, obviously known as the king of strong style, and Drew McIntyre, the Scottish psychopath also known for his really hard-hitting style so this match is going to be a really really interesting one and here he comes our extreme style champion crown at the GCW Raw Rumble. He is also the reason this belt got brought into existence at the first place. Um, this dates back to last year's GCW WrestleMania 6 when Nakamura and Wyatt went to war and owner Mr. McMahon want to see wanted to see more of this kind of style in GCW so he decided to bring in a championship belt and if this match gets any close to what was Wyatt and Nakamura last year this match is going to be brutal McIntyre obviously a way different opponent than Bray Wyatt for Shinsuke Nakamura. Um, I wonder how Ma Nakamura fares against McIntyre here tonight. And here we see the prize that is on the line, the beautiful brand new GCW Extreme Style Championship. Here it is again. And here we go, Nakamura going right after McIntyre with a boot. Now, want to follow it up with the knee to the ribs. Brutal by Nakamura. Nakamura now into the ropes, but McIntyre runs through him like a freight train, my god. McIntyre now throwing Nakamura onto the knees and following it up with another one, my god, to Nakamura's ribs. And now McIntyre going into the ropes. And what a lariat turns Nakamura inside out. Was it outside in because this came from the back, but no matter what, it was brutal. And now McIntyre going to follow it up with some right hands to Nakamura. And now here choking him in the corner. Now uh, there's no rope breaks here uh, because this is the extreme style, but uh, Nakamura now getting a hold of McIntyre and somehow getting him outside of the ring and they land hard and Nakamura following it up now with some right hands to 
and McIntyre on the floor. Nakamura putting McIntyre into the post, but McIntyre blocks. Nice form by McIntyre. Lifts him up. And the rips go into the barricades again. And McIntyre. And Nakamura goes into the ring post hard. But I think luckily his it was only his back. His head didn't hit. Otherwise, he might have had a concussion here already. And now what does Drew McIntyre have in mind here? Nakamura counters with a kick to the face. And now Nakamura going after McIntyre. Nice takedown here by Nakamura. And another kick to the back of the head of McIntyre. And now Nakamura might be getting some control. But McIntyre, what a suplex. Belly to belly suplex. And he's following it up with another one. And Mock Nakamura crashes down on the mad heart. I'm surprised how Drew McIntyre's dominating Shinsuke Nakamura here. Now, and McIntyre putting Nakamura up. But oh, nice strike from Nakamura. And he wants to follow up that with a Kinshasa to the back of the head. But Nakamura and McIntyre moves out of the way. Another kick here by Nakamura. Uh, what? McIntyre counter. And oh, high angle powerbomb. Nakamura able to kick out here, but that was close. What a hard powerbomb by Drew McIntyre. Now McIntyre getting and Nakamura back up going for a suplex. But what is Nakamura doing? Backstabber! And coming all the way down from that suplex, I think that backstabber had some extra power on it. And then it would normally have had a Nakamura now on the outside here on the apron. Nakamura running and wow, what a knee to Drew McIntyre's back of the head. Back in the ring here, Nakamura is uh, looking for his knee strike. I think there he goes. Oh, oh, what a, what a Glasgow kiss. And I think that might not only have knocked out Nakamura, but also McIntyre. He's down. The, these hats cl clashed into each other hard. And, but McIntyre able... I think McIntyre is coming back to his senses. He still looks a little bit dizzy here after ramming his head right into Nakamura. So that, that was brutal. And now he wants to follow it up with the future shock. DDT Nakamura is out. But no, Nakamura. Nice slam counter here. Nakamura. And now he might be able to hit that vicious Kinshasa knee strike to uh, Drew McIntyre finally. Nakamura goes for it, but McIntyre catches him. Back suplex, Nakamura on his feet. Nakamura going for the exploder. McIntyre on his feet. Claymore! Claymore! Just like that, Drew McIntyre gets his first title in GCW. But Nakamura has his foot on the rope. Foot on the rope. Pin stopped. How did Nakamura do that after that um, Glasgow kiss and followed up by, by the Claymore? Unbelievable. But uh, what is Drew McIntyre planning right now? He's running and he's going for another Claymore and it hits just like at the Rumble. This is how he eliminated Shinsuke Nakamura from the Rumble and Nakamura crashed hard to the floor. I don't know if Nakamura is able to continue this, but what is Drew McIntyre? He's not going for his knee drop from there. That could crush Nakamura's head. Knee drop, but Nakamura out of the way, luckily. That would have cost Nakamura the match, maybe his career. But he got out of the way, and McIntyre's knee seems hurt. Yeah, McIntyre's knee crushed into the floor, and he's telling the official that he, that he can't get, get up. His knee is crushed, maybe, but Nakamura doesn't care. Pulls him back into the ring and goes for the exploder. And it goes through and uh, McIntyre landed on that knee again. And you can see the pain in McIntyre's face. And Kinshasa and just like that, Shinsuke Nakamura turned this match around. But oh, McIntyre out it too. But what does this for McIntyre? He can't even get up. Now he's telling Nakamura to finish him off. And Nakamura going back, I think going for another Kinshasa. 
but all charging Glasgow kiss. And if Shinsuke Nakamura didn't have a concussion yet, he has now. And McIntyre somehow on one leg trying to get Nakamura up. Following it up, Future Shock DDT. Nakamura down. And that is it. Drew McIntyre has won the Extreme Style Championship on his first try here on the huge stage of GCW WrestleMania 7. And now you see uh, Shinsuke Nakamura and some medical personnel coming to check on him because uh, what happened to Nakamura's head tonight uh, wasn't human, ladies and gentlemen. But there you can see on the stage Drew McIntyre, our new Extreme Style Champion. And um, we are far from done yet. Next up, we have the GCW Tag Team Championship match between the Young Bucks and Braun Strowman and Ray Wyatt. Um, I don't know what that means for the Young Bucks, but I, I think we might see some new Tag Team Champions tonight as well because Strowman and Wyatt together as a team, I don't see that they can be stopped.